consider ground like an expressionist, so I kind of just let the pain dictate what it's supposed to do and what it's supposed to put everything out. It's just kind of splashes around with like some ideas in my head. But I think uh, with this particular particular collection, you know, it was more thought out. You know, I would have like all the images, like, even before I started any painting, I would have all the images of the, the photos that I would be using laid out and um, how those photos made me feel to take the colors and put the colors out and then I just like started with that first layer and the search was came. story in a series and what each color down to what each color means what each line means what each you know the rhythm of each piece but for now as long as I just keep just peeling the layers off and I think for me I think the testament of a good piece of artwork not that I'm saying why my work is good uh, you be the judge of that but the testament of a good piece of artwork is the honesty and not just you know, not just the honesty in what you see, but like how honest the artist was feeling at the time that they weren't. First, I felt vulnerable, and then after a bit, I felt like, you know, this is something I want to share, this is something I want people to know about me. And then more so even, but now I want people just to like, even though they, they see my story, I want people to reflect on their own stories, as cheesy as that sounds. Like I think it's it's super important for all of us to just kind of like cherish those moments and that help to build who we are right now and like even the ones that are still happy. Because I feel like in this world especially today's climate and everything that's going on, um, our minds are just stretched in every direction.